Lewis Wan. Lewis is Chief Investment Officer at Pride Investment Group. Well, why, why the positivity? I mean, it's, surely it's as good as it gets to them. Yes, uh, to us, a 10% 10, 10 or more, more, more than 10% growth is considered to be a very healthy growth uh, in the first quarter. And we also believe that the second, uh, starting from the second quarter, the Chinese banks will uh, regain their momentum in their long growth because it is the government's intention. We see some, some signals from the government uh, will relax the policy in the second half. So uh, the, the lending will, will have a, um, a better growth potential in the second quarter. And several guests sitting where you are saying that uh, overall growth is going to slow down. That's going to take its toll. Earnings growth will, will slow down and uh, saying just be cautious out there. Uh, two factors will affect the earnings. The first one is the loan book. That means that the growth in the loan book. Uh, we be believe in that in the first quarter because the government continued the tightening policy. The loan growth is still uh, at a very um, a sl uh, low so level. So you, you're talking about reserve requirement uh, cuts which are going to help yes. to engender more loans. Is that what you're suggesting? Yeah. Yes, they have already two cuts in the RRR uh, 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 since the last December, it, uh, but in the second quarter, in, in order to rescue the overall economy, so we are thinking of the further cuts in RRR or even the interest rate cut, it is uh, the other possibility. For the, uh, the other factors affecting the bank's results are the NPL ratio. Uh, in the first quarter result, we see that the NPL ratio is actually decreasing. Yeah, so, it's, it's, you're talking about non-performing loans Non-performing yeah. loans, yeah. So, but uh, the things they're almost, as one person was suggesting to me, suspiciously low. Yes. Uh, I would say it is the, the problem, uh, the Chinese problem in terms of MPL is too low rather than, rather than too high because in order, because of the tightening policy, they cannot lend the credit to the, uh, to the, to the, the second tier, to the riskier mm -hmm. companies. So that's why right now uh, the, the company having the credit is the, uh, is the corporation with very good reputation and very good, uh, very good collaterals. So that's why we are thinking of the MPL is in, it, in such a low level, we are not uh, particularly, uh, particularly uh, worried about the, the ratio will, okay. will, will start decreasing when or is, increasing. When is a non-performing loan a non-performing loan is a question. There are many credit problems some of these Chinese banks have had as well. Yeah. Right, okay, are we through the worst of that? Okay, I guess uh, you're talking about um, um, the government financing vehicle. Yes. Uh, that is the, one of the key issues to be the, uh, discussed in the market. But uh, to us, we are thinking of that kind of uh, government, uh, local government loans will no, no longer will be a big problem because right now the government uh, let the, the local government to issue the bonds to, yeah. to repay the debts. And the, second, uh, and the second one is they allow the banks to extend the, 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 the term of the loan so as to, 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 to ease the pressure, especially during this uh, tightening uh, period of time. Okay, so which are the ones that you like? Do okay, you like all of them? I'm sure you don't like all of them. There must be some that you like more and some that you must want to stay, steer clear of. Yes, I, uh, our two favorite uh, topics are the uh, Agricultural Bank of China and, rural, uh, and uh, Chongqing Rural Commercial Bank. That is the two banks uh, targeting on the rural areas with the uh, uh, better growth potential. Is that because of the, the attempt, of course, by Beijing authorities to try and depend more on the consumer? Is that the reason why? Because these are uh, both consumer-related banks. Yeah, that is the, uh, the one of the reasons. But the key reason is uh, we see that the government spend the, uh, a lot of financial resources on, on, on pushing up the economy in the rural area. So these two rural banks will be, will be the key beneficiaries. Okay, which are the ones you don't like? Uh, right now I would say the Bank of China because uh, it seems that when compared with the other peers, it seems that the no, no longer in, in, in the long-term growth or the, or the credit quality, it is not particularly in, um, uh, attractive at the moment. Lewis, pleasure having you on the program as ever. Lewis Wan there from uh, Pride Group Investments. Thank you very much indeed.